okay <coughs> so let's begin here with creating a simple java project in eclipse so first what we need to do is click on file menu new and here you can find simple other option where you need to go in the other option a dialog box will appear where you need to type java and it will give you a java project option hit next then type a project name like project tutorial hyphen zero one leave the rest of the option like execution environment will be jre and the project layout and things will be as per the configuration default script written in the eclipse itself and next you need to click next click on finish and it will create an empty project here it will ask you or prompt you to change the perspective that you can change in time you have the option here in the window menu where you can open a perspective so here we have a project we expand the project to see a src folder where we create our java source code right click on it and again choose new and first you need to choose a package option to create a package before creating any class so I specify the name of the package as com.srk.pkg I click on finish and as I can see here the package is created right click on it new and click class to add a new class to your project ok so you can see here uh, java class dialog box appears type in the name for the project here sorry the class here like uh, it should be like first and if you want to generate main on fly check this option and click finish ok so here is the first java file that we have just created here inside our package it have a main empty main so let's write in something here we can use the shortcut like sys out and hit control space all together to generate the system dot out dot print ln line and write a message over here like hell and least Dot dot and that's it what next you need to do is click on the save all button and all the changes in the project will be saved and respective class files are generated as soon as you hit the save button now to run this file or this project containing lot of files we just right click on the file or the project and from here the menu appears like you want to run it in server or java application click on java application and here in the console as it's a console application you can get the output file and this that's it we will see next tutorial about creating web applications so that's it